a moment of situations where it would be great to remote control your camera for video or stills. Now, think about doing it with the phone or even tablet you normally have with you. I'm Rudy Winston with Canon USA, and in the next few minutes, we'll show you what's possible with many Canon EOS DSLRs and mirrorless cameras using the camera's Wi-Fi and the Canon Camera Connect app. We'll use an EOS R6 Mark II, but again, this can be done with many Wi-Fi equipped EOS and even PowerShot models. First, download and install Canon's Camera Connect app onto your phone or tablet for compatible Android or iOS devices. Even if you already have installed the Canon Camera Connect app, it's always a good idea to see if an updated version is available and install it if it is. Then pair the Bluetooth on the camera and mobile device. Select Shoot Remote Live View Shooting from the main Camera Connect window on your phone or tablet by tapping it on the device's LCD screen. Live viewing through the camera lens should start and be visible on your device's screen. At the top, tap to select still images or video. Now you can use the mobile device as a remote controller. Along the bottom, you'll see entries for a number of camera adjustments, which you can change from the device via its Wi-Fi control of the camera. You'll also see entries to tap on the device's screen to change the camera's ISO, exposure compensation, and even some flash adjustments if a speed light is connected. If the camera has a mode dial, you won't be able to change camera exposure modes, although this is possible on cameras like the EOS R5 that don't use a mode dial. You can also select and move AF areas by just tapping the screen on the mobile device. Tap the large round button to fire the camera. Images taken by default are recorded on the camera's memory card. To view and send images from the camera to the phone or tablet, go to the Camera Connect app's main screen and tap on Import Images. After joining the network, which connects the camera and device to the stronger Wi-Fi connection, the mobile device will then show thumbnails of the files on your camera's memory card. Tap on any one image or video file, or alternatively hold your finger lightly on an image for a few seconds to select it and allow selection of other images to send to the phone or tablet. A check mark appears in the corner of each selected image. Now, at the bottom of the Camera Connect app screen, tap Import. You'll be asked whether to send full res or reduced size JPEG versions to the device's Photos folder, then click OK. The images will transfer to the mobile device, and you can now easily email them, upload them to social media sites, and have them available to show friends or even clients at any time. Using your phone or tablet as a remote controller opens the doors to some tremendous possibilities.